Oh, God. Oh, <laughs> nothing. Thank you. Thank you, Odin. Thank you for trouble. Where's my... <laughs> oh my god, thank you Abyssal Razor. Wait, he's gonna spawn right here in my... Uh... Welcome everyone, welcome back to another episode of our Hardcore Permadeath Adventure. We're doing the melee challenge now. So, uh, yeah, we're back at it again. It was a rather unsuccessful, the last episode was a rather unsuccessful episode. So, uh, we did achieve some things. But first, world settings, to my right. Second, stats, right here, in the middle of the screen, for you to see. And, uh, also, I want to thank you, I want to say <laughs> thank you to Kate and to Russell for being uh, dear friends and... Uh, members to this channel. Okay, so uh, a few things have changed. I got finally, finally got <laughs> the turnip stew. I also finally got the medium healing and we got brewing here some uh, poison resistance for the future swamp if we're gonna make it to the swamp. Also, I've got myself another stack breaker. For obvious reasons, we're gonna need it. We're gonna need it a lot. <laughs> Yes, but we're not joking around. I've spent my last half an hour watching turnips grow. Now they're all ripe. I'm not gonna bother with those. We're not gonna waste any more time. We're just gonna jump straight into the boat. Fortunately, I had an event while I was in the base, so we're good to go. Let's just repair the... Uh, maybe the boat too. Yeah. The workbench, so at this point we're good to go. What I want to do is I have a plan, eventually. I came up with a plan, with an idea. Since the Veggies of Ear, the runestone, right? Pointed me towards the Haldor, the trader's location. Pointed me toward that location, or that direction. I'm gonna explore, we're gonna do some dungeons around that area. And, uh, well, try and find <laughs> another runestone in those dungeons. Because I really need a clear shot, a clear direction. Like, I know the area. It's clearly not on this island. However, I don't know exactly where. So, in order for us to find that, I'm gonna go, I'm gonna sail this way. This is way quicker. I just realized when I came back home this way. The other way is a uh, long run, but I, I had no idea, so, uh, yeah. Now we know. <laughs> okay. I'll be back with you once we reach Haldor and we can uh, discuss the future plan and look for some dungeons there. You know, I just realized there are a few dungeons on this side. We don't even need to go up until we find Haldor. Let's try these first. I can't remember if I've explored them or not. I do believe we'd we've explored one of them at least because I can spawn one right there the blue haze right there in the distance and there's another one close by I do believe we've explored this in the early episodes however I'm gonna try and see maybe they have a uh, rune stone in one of those so let's try your luck oh you spooked me there for a second there's one right here now I think we're gonna go for the speed. Even if we die, it's still way, way easier for me to run around um, having all the speed. I don't believe we're gonna go for armor. This looks explored. We're gonna double check. Yep, kinda looks explored. <laughs> uh, why is this door closed? Sir? Okay. Now, I just need a rune stone, if you'd be so kind as to point me towards... Nothing. <laughs> point me towards my doom. A lot of mushroom, not a lot of action. Oh, come on. Oh, come on. Why are the do doors closed if I've explored this? Wait! Ah! Hello! 
Okay, this is unnecessary and totally over the edge. How have I explored this? Oh, do they respawn? So the enemies respawn? I don't know. I, I... In my mind, I've explored this. We did explore this, didn't we? We're gonna get the sterling cores. We're gonna, we can deposit those in the boat. Um, certainly this doesn't look explored. At this very moment. Let me go here. Here. Please, please, please. No. <laughs> nothing. A big pile of nothing. Well, it is what it is, folks. Moving on to the next one. Because there was another one. I'm just gonna keep my eye on the food. So I need to eat really soon. I'm gonna keep the good food for the elder for the elder fight. One way or another I'm gonna find it. I'm gonna find it. That ancient root. That ancient stump. Oh look, we even have a fire in this one. We have two fires. Okay. Oh, this one's the one with the stairs. Now I remember. Ha <laughs> ha. Okay, so we go up here. Go up here. Wait, didn't I have a rune stone in here? No, they should. There should be one right here. Apparently, there's not. I can remember the dungeon, but I. <laughs> oh no. Well, my friends. Apparently, I run into some mushrooms. Again and again. Sorry for the speedy way of me navigating these hallways. Probably makes no sense to you whatsoever. Makes no sense to me because the only thing that I'm seeing is now yellow mushrooms all over the place. Come on, I should have checked the videos. What's wrong with me? I should have checked my videos. Yeah, sorry about this. Can't remember. <laughs> yeah, okay, so we're gonna do it the old-fashioned way. We're gonna do it the old-fashioned way. Meaning, uh... We need more dungeons. And fast! Need more dungeons and we need them fast. Okay, false alarm. Well, it was worth a shot. It was worth trying, at least we now... <laughs> we know now... Uh, we know that these are empty. And they have no runestone. There's another island right here. No island right there. There's one here and there's one there. I think that's the one that we've explored. So I'm gonna try and go back to uh, Halder, like I said. And yeah, I'll catch you when we get to Halder. Yeah, I keep calling it Halder, but it's actually our small little outpost here. <laughs> but yeah, the trader is nearby. I can feel him. I can smell him. And yes, I still haven't got the Jing 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 or the belt. Honestly, I'm waiting to grab more gold since we're gonna need a lot of Ymir flesh thingy to grow to have the uh, the iron sledge. So yeah, let's rest here by the place where we almost got killed by a troll because I missed the first attack on him. <laughs> Feel free to check that in the last episode. Right, so we're gonna take a nap here, quickly. And uh, look for more dungeons. We're just gonna go in the forest. I, I just need one, one altar. Not asking for a lot of things in this game. <laughs> but we do need one more altar. One more Veggie or one more runestone. Please don't start raining on me. Look at that, 56 days. I also learned my lessons on these ladders. If you run down from the top all the way to the bottom, the game registers a fall. Because that's normal. So, <laughs> normal mechanics. I'm not too scared of trolls at this point. They're big and blue and usually I can spot them before they can spot me. But I do need... Let's wait for stamina. Never, never run up a cliff like this. Especially on the mountain. Without your stamina bar. Things can go south pretty fast. Now, 
That looks like something. Let's check it out. See the blue haze in the distance? And another blue haze right there. And there's a dungeon right here. See, this is what I love about the dagger. Man, it's super, super powerful. Oh, you're a one-star skelly archer. That's cute. You're you're packing some damage. There's another dungeon right there. Right, but we are uh, taking care of this one first. God, please, let me have an altar. Also, this is rather dangerous. We could die in one of these. If I get a one-star uh, or a two-star skelly archer... Oh, God! That's gonna be problematic. Is it over? Now I'm still damaging something. Which is good, honestly. Because I could use all the clubs damage okay this is ridiculous and what's here at this point what am i damaging <laughs> oh nothing thank you thank you odin thank you jesus thank you <laughs> oh this is such a pleasant sight i think i'm gonna cry i'm gonna cry those tears of happiness wow that dagger is really close to my face okay let's not carve our face with the dagger and um Look at this! We even found feathers. Not that I need them. Okay. <laughs> Look! Map location already added. Yes, but I need to see it once more. If you would be so kind as to show it to me. That way? Hold on. Show me it again. I'm not touching the mouse. That way. Definitely that way. We got our direction. We're gonna finish looting this dungeon. Because I kind of need the gold. So, uh, and you kind of need some action. I know you guys like some action. So, I'm here to deliver. There you go. Melee action in the dungeon. I'm wasting all my attacks by hitting the walls. So, that's the best type of action. <laughs> Always keeping the feathers out. But yeah, I do need the bones. Because I've run through, run through all my bones, crafting the second stack breaker. So we do need some good bones. Okay. One more door left in here. Now nah, you missed me. But I miss you even more. Darling. Okay, so uh, she's kind of bony. Right, let's get out of here. <laughs> okay. Silly jokes? Yes, check. Elder Trajectory, check. This way. How is the Elder that way? Am I missing something? It's impossible, that's impossible. It keeps sending me to the other island. Maybe it's on the other island. Wait, this is silly. This is... Have I changed something or, or this trick does it does no longer work? Maybe this trick is no longer working. And I'm wasting my time looking for Elder. Looking for an Elder that I'm never gonna find. Hold on. Where was it? Oh god. It was on the first door to the right. Yeah, there it is. Veggies of Ear, the Elder. It says that way. For the love of God. How is it that way? Is this trick no longer working or what? Or am I just plain silly? Okay, God, I'm... <laughs> I'm really confused at this point. This has never happened to me before. How is the Elder that way? Okay, now no matter what, I'm gonna have to get back to the base. That way, says. 
Oh my god. Well, we're gonna go that way. Whichever that way means. Watch me getting lost trying to find this guy. It says that way. Okay, no matter what, we need to get arrested buff. And we're gonna sail that way. Because that looks like a normal direction for... Okay, whatever. I was kind of hoping something... Since it pointed us towards this location, I was hoping something there. Not that way. Or maybe it's that way. Yeah, it kind of looks... There's, a little, there's an island right there, so we're gonna go for that. Can you see the outline of it? Yeah, I can see it from here. It's just a tiny shade in the distance. Okay, we're gonna go for that. Can't slip at this time. Are you sure about that? Okay. We can have the rest of the loot in here. Can't we? Yeah, we can have it in here. We don't need it at this point. We can't sleep, yes. Um, thing is... Come on, get rested. There's the monster downstairs. Okay, so we need the rested buff and we're gonna sail that way. Now I'm not gonna change my mind. It looks... It looks like that way is the way to go. Although it uh, kind of pointed from the dungeon, so we are a few meters off. Or a few feet... Off. Come on. I'm coming for you. I'm coming. Don't worry. You're just here to ruin my buff. You're just here to ruin my rested buff. Okay. Sailing that way. It is. So that way. Okay. Okay. I'm good. Let's go. Again. I can't check it right now. <laughs> okay. I can see a small outline of an island right there. So that way it is. This looks wrong. Okay, let's go. Let's go that way. I can see there's some land right there. You can see the land. If we're not going to die at sea by um, having a storm or something and being capsized. We're sailing that way. Oh, you can... This is really close. You can actually see the pines. Oh, I don't even have to cut the video. <laughs> Ooh, nice. Okay, that way. We're gonna look this island. If it's not here, maybe it's on another island. But if it's on this, uh, if it's not on this island, I'm gonna look another for another dungeon because that's the way to go. Find those veggies of your stones, and eventually they will point you in the right direction. One thing is clear, though, um, we are one step closer to finding him. Please don't give me the fog. Why? Why? No. Come on, we had we had such a nice time. Why do I need the fog? I need to find a spot to land to we need to dock the boat. To drop our anchor. I was wondering why I'm not moving at all, but <laughs> we had no wind. There's a cool little gulf here going on. So, uh, yeah, it doesn't look like it's here. It doesn't look like anything is here. Okay, we can dock it right here. Okay, yeah, backward it. This is taking forever. Uh, we do need... I just need to make a run around. It's a lot of rather small island. I need to make a run for this island and uh, look for something. Look for uh, the altar. If it's not here, we're gonna look for dungeons instead. But my rested buff, however, is kinda going away. Also, we're uh, at the middle of the day, which means ten more minutes to night time. Which means, which means danger. Now you guys are, um, are just, yeah, yeah, you're, you're not worth it. Okay, moving on the edge of the island. Looking inside for trouble. Looking for trouble. Where's my... Woo! 
Ooh, hoo, hoo. I was like, where's my stamina bar? There you go. So it was right here. That is awesome. It looks like a nice flat area too. We can work with this. Because I need to craft a special arena for my friend right here. Yeah, no, go away. Uh, but first, um, first things first. We need to clear the dungeons around this uh, bad boy. So clear the dungeons, look for trolls. Also, but I may be asking for too much. A nice Grey Dwarf Tower would be great to have. That looks like a troll cave right there. So we need to take care of that. Is it a troll at the entrance? Maybe it is, it didn't load. Yep. Or not. It's just a rock. Sometimes these rocks look like trolls. Okay. That means we can have a nice camp right here. I do want to clear this thingy. Okay, we can have our camp right here with the rusted buff and everything. Okay, let's clear this dungeon first of the troll. So, uh, in case of anything, I can just jump in here. Oh, sun is the one with the log. Um, yeah, we're gonna wait for him to turn around or turn sideways, because there's no way I'm gonna find him right like this. Even though I could pack some punch. Why risk it? If it wasn't permadeath, I would be so much comfortable with this troll. Fighting him, dodging him. Like, even if you miss one dodge roll, if you die, you can come and collect your items. Or even even if you can't collect your items, you can start over and uh, learn from your mistakes, I guess. But at this point, we're gonna wait for him to turn around. Shouldn't be too long now. Come on. Oh, this is, this is gonna go either really good or really bad. Oh my god! Thank you, Abyssal Razor! For your sweet damage! We totally obliterated him. Well, that's nice. Well, that's amazing. He doesn't have chests. Why would he? I could have used all that wood so we can uh, skip the farming. It is what it is. So let's just grab some wood then and start uh, start working. Oh, it's gonna get rain. Oh, it's gonna rain on me. Rain on me. Thank you. Thing is. I still haven't cleared every single dungeon around this place, so a lot of preparation is still due. I'm gonna start working on the arena, that's gonna take me a lot of while. <laughs> a lot of whiles? One while, two whiles. Okay, uh, that's gonna take me a lot of time. What am I talking about? So thing is... Oh, guys. Oh, you got a blue friend! It's a blue key card. Ooh. There we go. Actually, can use the uh, stone that they provide. I just don't need the forest to move right now on me. Okay. First things first. Campfire, check. Wood in the campfire, check. Workbench, check. Protection against most dangerous raids. Where's my uh, protection? There's my protection. Always wear protection, kids. I can get through here. The enemy can't. Can I get through here? Yes. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I was like super cocky that I can get through there, but uh, kind of looked problematic. Good, we now have a place to rest our feet. We now have storage units for our items, preciously earned items. I'm kind of neat, and I by if you have watched these series, by this time you kind of know that. 
So I'm kind of a freaky little neat person. So <laughs> I need to have everything in order. Everything m must make sense. Okay. So, food, 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 food. We can drop the bad food in here. Well, it's the good food, honestly. Whoa, what am I not talking about? This is the good food. This is the bad one. Right. Can we repair the Abyssal Razor? No. That's a problem. I should have brought myself some... Uh... Okay. I'm gonna start working on the arena in the morning. So, in case of any raids, I'm just gonna jump back to this uh, little cave. There are no dangerous raids at this moment. So, uh, yeah. Let's start working on the arena. And I forgot to bring my... Oh, no, it's right here. Thank God. <laughs> I was like, I forgot to bring my hoe. Day 57. By day 60, we should be done with the arena. I'm gonna need to mine a lot of rocks around this area. Still, 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 let's not lose our heads. So that's it. We're gonna fight him this episode. I forgot to bring the ancient seeds, so we might not fight him in this episode. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Even if I have to go back home and cut the, uh, the entire trip. We're, we're fighting him, it's happening. We've, we found him, we're gonna craft the arena, and we're gonna fight him. Just need to look around for uh, any suspicious activity. Any suspicious Great Worthy activity. The pesky little things. Bam, bam, bam. Oh, actually, we need to keep the rocks on us now. <laughs> They're kinda important. And we kinda need them. Okay, so we clear this dungeon. I don't see... Yeah, we might need to get back home. I don't see any spawner on this island. This looks like a small little island. Okay. Unless I find myself a brute in the middle of the night. Which I don't think so. Killing enemies with this dagger feels like you're slapping them. It's bang, like this. Like a bang. <laughs> oh, what am I talking about? Right, time to work on the arena. So, the main idea, I'm just gonna share it with you, and I will bring you back when this whole thing is over. The strategy for me, when it comes to this big guy, is as follows. We're gonna flatten this area, a large area, around the base. Make it as flat as possible. As flat as this uh, game allows it. We're gonna have a wall right on the edge of that. And we're gonna encase ourselves in here with him. So in case of a troll, in case of any attacks, we don't have to bother with those, right? So we don't need to bother with trolls and anything else, we just need to focus on the actual Elder fight. This is why we're, uh, I'm doing this, right? Okay, so uh, like I said, flattening this area. We're gonna flatten this large area. I'm gonna raise walls around it. And I'm gonna create a special little tower for me. I'm gonna take out my bow and shoot it from that tower. Okay? That's what I'm gonna do. We're gonna take the bow and shoot it. We're gonna risk anything. Just kidding. <laughs> Just kidding. This is the melee only. We're only having melee weapons. Look at this. This is, this is ginormous. <laughs> I'm gonna hang it on a wall somewhere. Okay, so I'm gonna have a special tower and go we're gonna use melee attacks from the tower. Can you guess how? Let me know in the comments ahead of the moment if you know how. We're not gonna do any spear throwing. So if you thought about the spear, think again. We're not gonna do any spear throwing. Okay, but uh, I'm gonna leave you to uh, think about it while I'm working on this, uh, on this arena. Fortunately, there are tons of rocks around this, so we won't have a problem uh, raising the walls around this. Like I said, nice flat arena around it. I'm gonna find a spot for my tower. This is the perfect location for uh, for an elder fight. It's flat. You don't have to bother with anything else. Everything is flat. I'm just flattening again, just so it looks rather neat. And uh, to have, it's it's important to have level ground everywhere. Okay, so uh, that's it. Let me take care of these guys, and I'll bring you back once the arena is over and finished. When all the work is over and the arena is finished, that's what I meant. Alright, I'm back after about one hour, maybe over one hour of uh, 
working on the arena. It's finally done. It's finally finished. I did have to go back because my pickaxe broke. So I did have to go back to base. I grabbed the ancient seeds so we don't have to do any more uh, farming around or looking for them. I changed the better food. So uh, in theory, this is it. Fingers crossed that everything goes well. Day 60, kept my promise, kept my promise, as promised. <laughs> uh, this is the arena. This took a lot of stone, like insanely amount of, st oh my god, <laughs> insane amount of stone. But yeah, let's hope that he spawns around here and we can actually damage him. Now he's going to be able to spawn roots there. I'm, I'm having a small nest right there, we're going to nest right there. Oh, I'm so scared. Uh, <clears throat> wait, he's gonna spawn right here in my... Uh... Oh, this is not what I planned. <laughs> oh, okay. Are those roots able to get me? I'm just gonna wait for the roots to disappear. Um, this is not what I've planned. Woo! There we go, friend. Let's do this. Wait for the roots. Oh! Okay. So he's supposed to come closer. If he's not gonna if he's not gonna come any closer, I'm gonna have to do this the old fashioned way. Okay. You know what? All this work all this work for nothing. Okay, come here. Go. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Let's wait for the HP. I haven't fought this guy in a long while. Come on. Wait for the roots. Okay, so I've worked on this arena for absolutely no reason. Ah, uh, well, there is one reason. I'm just trying to focus. There's one reason why we got this. <laughs> okay, come on. Yeah, man. Ah, uh, we're safe from trolls at least. So, no enemies will be able to get in here. That's what uh, we've achieved. You're dealing kind of a pokey damage. Go. I've learned my lessons, stay away from those. Come on, start shooting. Yeah, so my, uh, my strategy didn't work. <laughs> it worked when I tested it. But this time, however, it doesn't seem to um, to work. Come on. Let's get it the old-fashioned way. Oh, I don't have any stamina. <laughs> Let's wait for the stamina. Okay, he's gonna rub the roots. Is that really gonna reach me? That's a bit weird. Come on. I'm between two roots and I'm scared. This is so not according to the plan. Oh! Woo. 
Ooh, that was a nice dodge, bro. Come on, come on, come on, come on. No, no, not the roots again. Oh, God. This is gonna take me forever. But there goes my plan. So all the other bosses are immune to this. This is the only one who can actually spawn in my... Uh, well, it's my fault. I didn't consider him spawning right in there in my tower. Come on, let's do this. Oh! Oh my god, that was the stupidest idea ever. Why? Why did you just... Oh, come on. That was, that was not fair, friend. That was not fair at all. I just went head on into the <laughs> into his attacks. Can I squeeze a few more in here? Yes, I can. Yes, I can. Whee! Look at him. Ah. Oh. Now this is quite the elder fight. And here you thought I was going to go for some boring fight with the Elder. I need to go get closer to him. And I need him not to spawn another set of uh, roots. Come on, come on, come on. We've done this before. Woo. Go, 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 go. Come on, get me. However, without Ikethir, I don't think this would have been possible. Come on, Roots, go away. One, two, three. One, two, three. Almost there. No, you don't spawn no Roots. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. And here I was planning everything, got a second stack breaker. Oh, folks. Oh my god. I have no words. Like, I have absolutely no words for this. Oh, it was perfect, but my arena was perfect. Why did he spawn right here? <laughs> oh my god, right on top of me. And I almost died at him. I got staggered by his vines. Thank god for the 35 armor. Also, he was not supposed to see us in here. I, sh I should have... Come on, I should have dug this deeper. Also, the roots. When I tested this, though... I went on my test character. Uh, he wasn't supposed to see us in here. So he was supposed to chill. Maybe I made the tower a bit too large. Because um, there's a room for the roots. Also those hit pretty hard. So I think I should have dug a bit deeper in here. He actually didn't spawn in the tower. Oh, we finally did it. We have the elder. Now all hell is going to break loose. All hell is going to break loose. We're going to have trolls. We're going to have Draugr raids. Yeah, so my swamp exploration will be um, will be aces. Let's get the rest of the buff ASAP. Quickly, quickly, quickly. And let's go and deposit a big head on a, uh, on a hook. <laughs> well, yeah, let's, let's get the rest of the buff. And I'll sail back to the main island. Then we can get back to the spawn location. And plant the actual uh, head. Oh, goodness. Goodness gracious. Oh my god, what am I doing? Hold on. I've pressed the wrong button, sorry about that. Yeah, <laughs> I pressed the Windows button. Okay, we're good to go, I guess. Ah, uh, hold on. Hold on, hold your horses. We have some loot in here. Yeah, we can leave this here. Oh, no. Well, it's good. It's always good to have a backup plan. So my, uh, my Abyssal Razor was the backup plan right here. But yeah, I did do something stupid. And I only 
did this silly thing because I'm recording at night time. I usually record these in the morning, but now I have rushed. I have rushed the video and yeah, almost died at the other. Thank God for the 35 armor and the HP. Ooh, son, we've done it. And of course, I'm going to have to sail against the wind. Not with it, but against it. Okay, so uh, one quick trip back to the main island. It's going to be a lot of sailing involved. <laughs> There's going to be a lot of sailing involved. So uh, I'll catch you back when we can... Uh, when I find the main island, I guess. So I'll be back with you once we reach the main continent. I need to get back to the second island. or Our island, right? And when we hit the first continent with the location, with the spawn location, uh, I'll be back with you. Oh, I'm so happy. Here we are, back to the main island. Watch, I was gonna have a raid. We haven't ever, we haven't had a raid in a while, so I'm expecting one. But no matter the raid, we're just gonna run away from it. So back at the main island. Now, in theory, if I recall correctly, go away. <laughs> Sorry. If I recall correctly, if I hug the shore. Here on the left side, we should be able to find a path that will lead us to a small uh, camp with some fire. Let me grab some branches so we can set the fire going. But it's not that close. We need to go quite some while. Uh, quite a while. Oh, for quite a while. Jesus. <laughs> like I said, I'm tired. I don't know how, how the heck I managed to pull off that uh, elder fight, given how tired I am, but it's fine. It's fine, it's all... It's, it's, oh yeah, that's the Great Dwarf Tower we did, we uh, feared to explore. I was so scared to explore that. Yeah, so it's all uh, it's all for the greater purpose, right? <laughs> for the greater good. I do know that I need to follow a long road back to those stones. But we're gonna do it together, I'm not gonna skip anything we're just gonna celebrate we're gonna talk about it i don't know what the future is but uh the future is swampy i know that at least there's the road thank you nice pathing now question of the day are we able to sleep in here or are we gonna get raided like crazy first thing because in this game you can get raided during the night time it doesn't matter. You're just gonna start seeing on a screen a message that says you're you're being raided. <laughs> yeah, imagine having trolls in the morning. Me and my bad mouth. Okay. Whew. I feel cold and it's raining. Day sixty one. We have Elder down in the melee run. Okay. So yeah, I was I was gonna talk about the plan. This is a rather long road. The stones are rather that way, however, I don't want to get lost, so we're going to keep uh, following this road. We're going to have the Ikethyr uh, buff soon, and we're going to come back using the Ikethyr. It's going to be a huge run. Okay, so, uh, talking about the future of the of the series, obviously we're going to go through the swamp, get all swamp gear. Problem is, I could use some Fenris armor. Those are risky. That's that's super risky for me yeah, to go there and fight those. I also would love to have some uh, extra armor. Maybe we're going to do a full set of iron armor. That's going to make us super slow. I don't know. But at least uh, it's going to keep us alive. I don't know. We might die doing that. <laughs> we might die going for armor. I don't know what I'm going to do in the Mistlands, though. Because imagine fighting Gyals with a spear. How do you aim at them? Oh, you can aim at them. Where is my spear going to land? It's going to take forever for, you, for the spear to land. And also, if I lose the spear, if I miss a throw, I know I need to get myself underneath uh, the Gyals. Right? Yeah, look at me worrying about Mistlands. We are not even in the swamps. <laughs> 
Right, so after we uh, clear the first swamp, we're gonna go for iron armor. I think that's the best, the smartest idea. We can rely on meads then uh, for um, protection. Look, we even have the Ike tier buff. We're just gonna pop that. And we're gonna go for it. Go, 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 go. We should be close now. I was so scared on the, the when I when we first started on this world I was so scared because we could I couldn't find the ocean. We went few uh I was okay, there we go. We went in a few directions, so uh let's uh let's cheer on it. Oh my god. <laughs> yes. <laughs> okay. I okay, I thought that was an event. Right, so when we first started this seed since it's this, it's a random seed and all all of the seeds that we're playing on are random, just to increase the difficulty, I decided to go this way. I decided to keep going into one direction. Maybe we're gonna find eventually. If you keep going into the same direction, you're gonna find the ocean, right? Wrong. <laughs> we found no ocean. So uh, we did end up taking a right hand turn right here because uh, this was this huge opening. Oh, such fun memories. It was this huge opening and I thought, you know what? Let's follow the opening and eventually we're gonna wind up in the ocean. Because you're bound to find the ocean, it's impossible not to find it. And of course, I remember that in the first day we fought a skeleton. So we fought two, actually. I think we fought one star skeleton right about here somewhere. Yeah, right about here. It was right here. Right there. You fought a one star skeleton. It was quite amazing. Uh, that could have been the end of the run, so it would have been the the uh, fastest run ever. Maybe a world record. Okay. Right, so now that we have everything prepared, the Elder Stone is set and ready to go. I'm still waiting for an event to happen. I don't want to, but we're gonna have an event once. Once we reach the base, we're gonna have an event. Our inventory is full up. We do need to go back and repair items. Uh, also, I kind of should go this way. Because uh, we're going to take it like a small detour, like a shortcut, if you will. There it is. Because there's the ocean. Okay, so, uh, right, let's get back home. And I feel super successful after we, what we have achieved at this point. So, it's going to be a triumphal return. <laughs> Let the horn sing, and let the feast begin. Oh yeah, they will add a they will add a new system of food in the game called the feast, which will gonna it's going to last longer. So uh, that's gonna be pretty cool. That's gonna be really cool. I'm curious to see what sort of a system they come up with once they release the update with the witch. Where am I going here? So now it's confirmed, sorry for the spoilers, but uh, if you haven't heard, it's a bog witch. It's a bog witch. It's a swamp witch. <laughs> yeah, swamp, bog, same thingy. Not really. Uh, okay, so let me find the boat. And after we get the back to the boat... There's the boat! Thank you. Let's not have an event right now while I'm in the boat. We're gonna do a bit of sailing against the wind, which will be super slow and annoying. That is all I got at this point. Um, can we take down the boat? No. Oh, we can if I throw these away. Three slots? Yeah. Okay. Let's tear down the boat. Let me grab the axe. It's faster if I tear down the boat and <laughs> make a run for it. Imagine that. It's actually faster. What am I doing here? Come on, get the sails. There's our raft. The first raft we built to to traverse this uh, body of water. Body of water, in this case. Uh, in order for me to do this, I kind of need the wind. I have to start chopping the boat down. As a small process, shouldn't take long. Oh, 
Oh, really? Now, uh, of course, we're gonna have no wind. Oh my goodness. Really? I swear this game hates me. Swear to God. Come on, start sailing that way. This rock is actually helping. Start sailing that way and keep it like this. It's over. The boat is done. Ooh, got all the materials? No, we don't need the resin. I need the nails. Give me the nails. There we go. <laughs> We're gonna have plenty of resin at the base. We don't need the resin. We're full up on resin. And okay, so I'm going like this. This is way faster. So, which is rather ironic because going on foot is way faster than going, uh, yeah, with the boat. So I will need 20 resin to get the boat back. But other than that, we're good. We're getting, about ho we're getting back home. We've achieved an amazing fit in this episode. And in the next episode, we're going to be deep into the swamps. Getting our hands uh, on the uh, root harness. That's going to be amazing. Hold on, let me stop burning your eyes for a second here. Let's get the SSEO going. Because I don't need... Uh, I don't need to be weary of the <laughs> of any shadows right now. I usually turn uh, off the SSEO in the swamp, or in the forest, or in the dungeons. That's gonna improve your sight by 100%. <laughs> it's like using night vision. The SSEO and some settings are actually making the game more difficult for you. So, uh, yeah. Keep in mind to turn them down. As you please. Also, the screen shake. For me, the screen shake is very annoying. Oh, God. It's the first time I'm out of stamina when I'm trying to fight something. But, yeah. Like I said, uh, the screen shake... The, the screen shaking is killing me. That screen shake is, is super annoying. Safety of our base. We can have any raid you want. In here, we're good to go. Where are my planks? Why are... Oh, I took him by mistake. Oh my god, I took him by mistake. Home sweet home. Like I said, I was surprised to see how many things we've achieved in this episode. I am super proud of ourselves. Even if we die in the swamp, it's, it's still an achievement at this point. We're full up on ice, Jesus. So, I want to get the boat back. Before anything else, let's get the boat go back <laughs> in, the, in the docks. But yeah, amazing, amazing feat. We do have miscellaneous boat. There we go. Carve. Carve. So we did achieve a lot in this episode. I'm looking for similar achievements in the next one. And then we're gonna have to take it up into the mountains. Yeah, I don't know about that. We need serpent meat for that. <laughs> I need to hunt some serpents. I need to bring them ashore with the abyssal harpoon. Where is it? This is it. The abyssal harpoon. Uh, we're having this. There's food everywhere in here. So I need to figure this out and everything else. So yeah, this is the episode. Thank you all so much for watching. It was a crazy episode. We almost died at the Elder. <laughs> But yeah, we didn't, so um, we're going to resume with the series. Thank you all so much for your support, thank you for, for being here with me, and I'll catch you in the next episode of our adventure. Bye-bye.